Dr. Ruto tells us that the disease is called dermatophilosis. This disease mostly affects the white parts of the cow and is spread by flies who lay eggs in the wounds. It is important other and the doctor wear protective gloves to prevent the spread of the disease. If this disease could have been dealt with at the early stages, it could have been easily treated and would not have spread, saving money on medication. Now, what the help can you give to my cow? This one can be treated using some medicine and uh, regular nursing. We normally call tender love care, TLC. How does he give a cow tender loving care? In the morning, wake up, come and examine. Touch it the way I was touching. Okay. You saw it. Yeah. Touch it, feel it, where there is pain. Now you localize your attention, attention. on that side. Yeah. Not only in the morning, pass by in the morning, maybe even around at the noon, it's yeah. okay, and in the evening. evening. Come and, and see it, and just some medication will give you just for anointing or the putting on the affected parts. Now it's time to start the medication. Dr. Ruto is now showing Arthur how to clean the wound and disinfect it. Water is added to the copper sulfate. This is an antifungal, which means to stop the fungus from growing. This needs to be applied once a day until the wound is healed. The doctor came in and checked the animal. What did he told you? He told me to, to cover the, the wound with the, its cow dung mm -hmm. uh, in order to prevent uh, more flies. Mm -hmm. yeah. Because using the cow dung to cover the wound, it's not, it's not good because you assist now the, the flies to hatch more on that wound, then it's spread all over the, the body. Then healing oil is poured directly onto the wounds. This assists in the healing and prevents the flies from laying eggs. An antibiotic injection is also needed to help prevent the spread of the disease. This one is 20 milliliters, once a day for three days. The sooner you can get access to a vet, the quicker the animal can get well and may need less treatment, saving money. Also remember never to use cow dung on a wound. This will make it worse and spread to the whole body. Now this cow has had right treatment and Arthur has good advice on how to look after it. It should make full recovery. Don't forget, good management of your cattle results in healthy animals. Coopers recommend feed supplements like Cooper Cola, Maclick Super, a salt and mineral brick. And cattle must always have access to clean water. What is the progress now? The progress is not bad, it's mm -hmm. doing well. Mm -hmm. I see how has done a good work mm -hmm. since the time I left. Uh -huh. uh, the cow is improving. Okay. Oh, he has given it the tender loving care. Yeah, TLC, it is okay. tender love and care. Uh -huh. Be with the animal daily, uh -huh. from morning, afternoon and evening. Yes, yes. I think you have done a good work, Mr. Hara. Okay. Yeah. This is good. So basically he has followed all the instructions. Yeah, yeah, he has done. Uh -huh. So now where do we go from here? Uh, from here, what we do now, We'll start again. Ah, the whole treatment? No, not the whole treatment as such, but few. We'll eliminate some, but we do may washing mm -hmm. and uh, we, we give an injection. Okay. And we give the other, other drugs. But the assurance is that the cow is getting better. It's getting better than what we, we, we found. Mm -hmm. Dr. Ruto cleaned the wound and treated the cow to ensure the skin problem was completely cured. 